This holiday was all Jess's idea. He wanted to surprise me. He used to come here as a kid and thought a cheap and cheerful holiday could be fun. We booked to go to a Greek island resort months ago now. And it was supposed to be her second honeymoon to try and put some spark back into our... Well, anyway, Jeff kept saying his body wasn't exactly beach ready. And to be honest, neither is mine. That's the kind of point of reaching the age we are. And we should be comfortable with it. But we're not gym bunnies or running fanatics. But what with the virus and the hassle of flying at the moment, we decided to, to postpone it. And yet again, so here we are embracing Skegness. And yes, it certainly is bloody bracing, even though it's summer. I mean, it were a total shock when I realised where we were going and I said so in no uncertain terms. Now we're here though, I'm actually enjoying it. Yeah, you have to take it for what it is, but in a strange way, it's made me feel like a teenager again, going into the arcades and the fairgrounds. I tried to persuade Jeff to go into a nightclub, but he wasn't having any of it. He's been a real misery guts, even though it was his idea. Anyway, we've just had a bit of a Barney and he went off for a long walk. I think the word short pier might have escaped my lips. The bottom line is that it's all changed too much for him. He doesn't recognise it as the place he came to as a kid. Well, that's only to be expected. Nothing stays the same forever. And maybe that's the problem, if I'm honest. I feel like I've changed over the years, but Jeff, well, Jeff is stuck in his ways and nothing is as good according to him. If we had gone to that Greek island, would I be feeling like this? Perhaps coming here has made me realise a few things, but I really don't know what I'm going to say to him when he comes back.